we now find moment of inertia of a solid sphere about its diameter let m is mass of the sphere r is radius of the sphere this is mass and radius so the density of the sphere is mass per unit volume 4 by 3 pi r cube that is 3m by 4 pi r cube this is density mass per unit volume let this circle represents the sphere this is the diameter at the center of the sphere now let us imagine a circular disk let us take the strip of this sphere say at a distance x from the center let the width of this strip be delta x let us consider this uh, point P here so this distance is radius now we have to find out the mass of this strip moment of inertia of this strip about this axis then we can integrate this moment of inertia because we can imagine this sphere to be made up of large number of many such disk okay we can integrate this equation that is the moment of inertia of this strip this uh, disk from 0 to up to this point 0 to r and multiplying it by 2 we can get the moment of inertia of the whole sphere so this strip has a radius so let us take out this strip let us cut this strip the strip looks like this this is the radius of the sphere and radius of this dis uh, strip let, let, let it be q so this is p this is q this point is center of the sphere this is o this distance is r this is x so the radius of this strip pq is r square minus x square and uh, the volume of this elementary disk is area into the width area is pi into radius r square x square this is the radius so this this is pi r square is the area into the the width of this width of this disk is delta x delta x this is the volume of this disk now mass of this disk is equal to the density into volume mass of the elementary disk is equal to 3m by 4 pi r cube into this thing pi r square minus x square delta x so pi pi cancel out that is 3m by 4 r cube r square minus x square into delta x now we have seen that moment of inertia of a disk about an axis passing through the center of this disk is m radius square by 2 so moment of inertia of this thin strip about this axis x axis will be equal to mass of this disk into radius square by 2 so moment of inertia of this elementary disk is mass of this disk is 3m by 4 r cube 
r square minus x square delta x this is mass into the uh, radius square radius square is r square minus x square by 2 this is moment of position of this elementary disk that will th this will become equal to 3 m by 8 r cube r square minus x square whole square delta x now we can imagine this disk to be made up of large number of many such strips so the moment of inertia of the sphere can be obtained by integrating this equation 3m by 8r cube r square minus x square whole square delta x from 0 to r from 0 x equal to 0 to r and multiplying this equation by 2 so that we get the moment of inertia of the whole sphere so just integrating this equation this is 6m by 8r cube and integration of r to the power 4 delta x is x r to the power 4 into x plus x to the power 4 integration will be x to the power 5 by 5 minus 2 r square constant integration of x square is x cube by 3 now put the limit 0 to r so we find that i equal to 6 m by 8 r cube 8 r cube this will be r to the power 5 plus r to the power 5 by 5 minus 2 by 3 r to the power 5 the whole things comes out to be 2 by 5 m r square so this is moment of inertia of the solid sphere about its diameter